There was a group led by a Chinese scientist called Xu Wenju, operating from 1988 to 1999. They found during three body alignments, that solar or lunar eclipses, that four different things were observed to clearly change. One, the crystallization of a lid tin alloy. Under the shadow in the three body alignment, it produced linear crystals, not random crystals. Two, a metal brass plate, which has spin nuclei in the copper, has some strain gauges, saw a sideways movement. So there's a, a push sideways during this three body alignment. Three, the spectral lines of elements change. That is so important because what is it that is partially reflected? by, say, the moon, and that causes a, a difference in the orbital levels of electrons. What would cause them to be at different orbits to produce a different spectral line? And then the last point was this. Cesium-137 and Rubidium-87 atomic clocks changed their count 